Guys, here's Ivan, my boyfriend. Nice to meet you. Your mom has told me a lot about you. This must be a joke, right? No, sweetie. Mom, I can't believe you're dating this guy. <laughs> he looks my age. Have you thought about what people will think? Or our family? Come on. Don't you think you're way too old already for this kind of ridiculousness? Josoni, please. Take it easy. You don't have to talk to your mom like that. How do you want me to take it easy? I'm sure this guy is only after my mom's money. Because I don't think he fell for your nice feelings, okay? Well, you're wrong. Because I love your mother. Please, sweetie. Give Ivan an opportunity. Get to know him. I won't do that. And I swear that if you don't break up with him, you have to forget you have a daughter. And you, you just want an enemy. Let's go. Just want me. Forgive her, please. I'll talk to her. Calm down. Everything will be fine. <laughs> Mom, I just came. For you to tell me you already broke out that stupid relationship. Hold on, Joswani. I want you to know one thing. I won't leave Ivan. <sighs> Why can't you understand that Ivan and I love each other? Sweetie, please. I want you to know him. So you see, Ivan is a good person. Oh, Mom. I can't believe this. He's making a fool out of you. Do you really think he loves you? That a young man like him will notice an old lady like you? Mom, open your eyes, he's using you! Of course not! I tried to find a way to leave him a thousand times, but he insisted. Well, of course, because I'm sure you fulfill all of his whims. Come on, Mom. Is your loneliness that bad? To screw a young man? Sweetie, please, please forgive me, Don't honey. Don't touch me. You've never put a hand on me. And I can did it just because I said the truth. Please, understand this. Ivan and I love each other. You once told me I should fall in love again. Well, yes, Mom. But not of someone my age. Patty. Ivan. What happened, my love? Are you okay? Well, the thing is... The swan is here. I think... It's better if you leave. But I came to take you out for lunch? Didn't you hear her? She said leave! <gasps> the swan is Leave from here. Be careful if you bother my mom again. What's this? Give it to me! Adi, what's wrong? Why don't you pick up my calls? Ivan, if I let you come home, it was just to say goodbye. But why? What's wrong? I don't want to have more problems with Joswani anymore. She... She asked me to choose between her and you. I don't get it. Why? Why doesn't she let you be happy? She herself was the one who insisted you to fall in love again. Well, yes. But not from a much younger man like you. Understand this, Ivan. You could be my son. Patty. I don't know when I fell in love with you. Patty, listen to me. Listen to me. I don't care about our ages. When I met you, you demonstrated to me you're a magnificent woman. Please, Patty, don't leave me. Let things happen. Let me love you. Don't fall for just one black mailing. 
Besides, she already has to stop. Okay, baby. <laughs> what the hell are you doing here? Wasn't I clear with you? Just want me. It's your mom's birthday, please. Just want me. I don't want to fight with you. The only thing I'm doing here is preparing a surprise for your mother. Can you get we're in love? I know what you love about my mom. And that's her money. And now this house. But let me inform you that I won't allow you to keep making a fool out of her. <sighs> Just want me enough. You're doing a big drama. The neighbors will notice it. You shut up. Stop meddling in this. Or what? Are you gonna be on his side now? No, Joswani. But stop meddling in your mom's life. She perfectly knows what she's doing. Joswani. I understand you don't approve the relationship I have with your mother. But I love her. And you or anyone will separate us. You may think what you want. But I will demonstrate to you that the only thing I want is to be with your mother. Over my dead body. To prepare yourselves, because the war starts today between us. Sweetie, you I... You lied to me. You told me you had broken up with this guy. And I'll demonstrate to you that the only thing he wants from you is your money. Joswani! Look at this. What we thought was gonna be a wonderful birthday. Look at how it ended up. Don't worry, baby. You'll see that just when he will think this twice. Let's go celebrate. She had never behaved that way. I don't know her. What are you doing? I don't know you. If you mean what happened with that gold digger, I just want to protect my mom. Joswani, I don't think Ivan is with your mom for her money. Is that it? Or are you afraid of someone replacing your dad's place? No one can replace my dad. Because he, he was an impeccable man. And I... Come on, look, stop saying stupid things. Of course I would accept but a normal relationship for my mom. Joswani, it's the 21st century. Why don't you get it? Even more, you're younger than me. And what's wrong with that? Everything. I will destroy that relationship, even if I have to play dirty. Well, don't do something you might regret later, OK? Now get in the car. Thank you, Daddy, for teaching me about cars. I promise you I will take care of my family, and I'll do that. Ivan can't be with my mom anymore. It'll be a shame his car ran out of brakes. <laughs> Baby, hey, I'm just calling to tell you that I'll drive your car. It's just that mine is being fixed. I want to go visit my daughter and fix things with her. Yes? Oh, thank you. I love you. I'll see you later. Bye. Oh, what's wrong? What's wrong? Why? Stop! No! Doing. The doctor hasn't come out yet, but if something happens to her, I'll die. I'm sure you were the one who caused that accident, sir. 
Stop, Josuen. It's not possible you want to fight at this moment. I mean, your mom is fighting for her life right now. Well, that's the truth. I'm sure you were the one who took off the brakes of the car. And you caused her an accident. What? But if I've never told you what was the cause of the accident... Just want the answer. Did you take off the brakes of Ivan's car? Answer, Yuswani! Well, yes, it was me! I never imagined that my mom would drive that stupid car! Yuswani, I don't know you! How far will you go because of your hate? Why can't you accept the relationship Ivan has with your mom? What will happen if your mother dies? Shut up! My mom cannot die! I won't forgive myself if that happens. Just when it's not possible. Look how far you've come. Were you trying to kill me? What's in your head? Patricia Lupercio's family? Yes. Doctor, how is she? Fortunately, everything was perfect with her surgery. If it wasn't for you and your blood donation, she wouldn't have made it. Can we go see her? Yes, I'll let you all in in a moment. Excuse me. Thanks, doctor. You saved my mom's life. That's right. Because I love her. And even though I hate needles, I'm willing to do anything for her. Ivan, thank you for demonstrating how much you love Patty. I've been so stupid. So selfish. Baby, calm down. <laughs> doing feeling any better baby so much better and how would I feel like that if you spoil me so much mom how are you feeling much better now Ivan I think it's better if we let them talk alone. okay no 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 don't leave I came to apologize. I know what I did is unforgivable. The only thing I want is to be happy. Ivan is a good person. I know we're not the same age, but we love each other. I got it. I proved it when you had the accident. Since then, Ivan didn't left your side. I judge him without knowing him first. Joswani, I don't want to, to take your father's place. I won't ask you to be best friends. The only thing I want is your permission to love and take care of your mom. From now on, if you want, we can start over again. Give me an opportunity, please. Sweetie, what you did was really serious. Give us time to process it. To be able to trust you again. I promise you, I'll make an effort for you to trust me again. Mom, may I give you a hug? 